Hello my Sagittariuses, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Ooh, I just split the deck and I got three of swords. So some of you guys might be nursing a broken heart here. Okay, let's see what else is going on. You might feel, I'm just hearing like you might be doing it alone. Like you might feel really lone, lonely as you're like sad. I don't know. Okay, let's get an overall energy from Sagittarius. Let's get one card for the overall energy for Sagittarius. This is also for cross watchers for Sagittarius. So if you're watching, could be for you if you're dealing with the Sagittarius. And look at this, we have temperance. I guess it's not really fully reversed. I'm going to take it upright, okay? Sagittarius energy. So... Things need to be in moderation right now for you. If you have been crying a lot, make sure you don't overdo it, okay? I know you need to grieve, but um, you feel like maybe something you put energy towards isn't working out. Change of course here. Queen of Wands reversed. Six of Swords reversed. Five of Pentacles reversed. Okay, if these are all reversed, though, I'm not going to take them all reversed. You see, Asa? Hmm. Let's get two more. These are all reversed, guys, which means the whole deck is just flipped over. So, um, oh, we've got the chariot. Um, I'm not going to take these all reversed, guys. There's too many reversals. Five of Pentacles, Six of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. I feel like you feel someone like moved away from you or like there's definitely like I'm here I feel like you're definitely missing someone here um we've got two aces though you're definitely on the brink of a new beginning if you guys have been going through a really hard period I feel like you're gonna get your mojo back for sure you see the ace of wands the chariot cancer energy could be dealing with the cancer Ace of Pentacles. There's something new worth investing in for you, Sagittarius. I love that this Ace of Wands is here and her wand is here. Now, I'm kind of wondering if you're almost like waiting for someone to give you your magic back, your wand back here. Could be a masculine. I don't know. I'm getting that there is kind of like a tender connection here, but you've lost your power or you're like relying on someone else to come give you permission to stand in your power. You went through a really like a season of a lot of loss here with this five of pentacles. But I do feel like out of nowhere, you're going to get like this brand new beginning. And I feel like you just literally have to keep moving, like keep swimming from, um, from, uh, what, I want to say Dora from, uh, what is it? Finding Nemo. It's like, I feel like there's magic in this journey. Like, you can't stop now because you've come too far. And it's time to, like, water your own garden and to, like, move away from whatever it was that was, like, holding you back in the past. Because literally, like, nobody can take your wand away from you, okay? This is you. Um, you have the power. It's like um, Dorothy. Like, I had the power. I just had to realize it for myself from the Wizard of Oz, that's also coming through. I think it's also about trial and error here. You see these all keep coming up reverse. Ten of Swords, you had an ending, could have been with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, <laughs> you know, I just got this feeling for some weird reason though. It's like, you're kind of playing dead. Okay, I also feel you could be like, someone could be trying to contact you and you could be making it like, you're really unavailable because you don't want to speak to this person with this king of swords like you're i just got this feeling like you're playing dead because you just you feel like i just heard also like dead end you feel like this situation is a dead end so we're gonna have to definitely explore that more sagittarius but you're not as powerless as you're making yourself out to seem it could be that you have a cancer here you have someone that's a better match but you feel like you've now let it on too far with this other person now that could also be switched if you're dealing with the Sagittarius and you're wondering why they're not answering your call I'm sorry to say but 
And we have Page of Pentacles. There's a there's definitely like with the Ace of Pentacles and this Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. There's definitely like this curiosity here for you guys. I definitely feel like you're on the brink of some really exciting new beginning, but you might feel some guilt because you have to let people go and you don't really know how to. So you're kind of like playing dead here. I don't know why that could let me know if that resonates for anyone. All right, let's get some overall energies. You're, you're acting a little dramatic there, Sag. Okay. Dreaming and turn away. You see? I don't know. I feel like you also kind of might feel like bitter because someone, you could be dealing with a Pisces with all these fish. Light. You feel like people have turned away from you and now you're kind of like, well, I want the power. I want to be the one to kind of turn away. So make sure you're doing it like make sure you're not turning away people that actually have good intentions because of all the betrayal you faced, okay? I'm gonna get a chakra card for each one of these, so dreaming. This is your time though to do what makes you feel right. I feel like you've been through enough BS that it's like you get to decide who you wanna give a chance to, who you wanna turn away, okay? You do have the power, but don't abuse it, I'm hearing, okay? self you see this is a time for yourself maybe you felt in the past you were like extremely apologetic crown chakra energy trusting yourself i'm hearing you see courage and abundant yeah this is beautiful energy guys so i think you guys know and i also would say don't even explain yourself to people because i don't think they really understand we have number 21 which is like the world the end of a cycle 8 and 66 those numbers can mean something to you but um the abundance really is waiting around the corner with that ace of pentacles um so you do might you might have to turn away some people and you might not it might not be that easy for you guys i'm getting okay we've got root chakra energy which is all about safety and security and physical experience staying rooted and then we have solar plexus which is all about confidence and believing in yourself and your decisions okay and willpower as well so those are themes that could be coming up for you sagittarius okay all right let's get some messages from you or your person seems like maybe there's something you want to express that you're not or they do All right, Sag, what are the messages here? What's the communication that's needed? Or maybe you don't want to communicate. Maybe you're done communicating. My answer is yes. Of course, my darling, yes. So if there's something that you guys have been wondering, like, is it going to happen? I feel like we have abundant, we have yes. So there is promising energy here, okay? You're not just at a, a dead end road. I don't know why that keeps coming up. I want to be with you. It's always been you. I feel this is also like you saying yes to what you actually want and to honoring yourself and believing that you could have exactly what you want, okay? Someone that really, like you really want to be with and they really want to be with you. I just heard um, Hootie and the Blowfish. I only want to be with you. I don't, I can't think of any of the other words to that song, but there could be something in those lyrics. Cause I'm, it's like at the tip of healing karmic wounds. It's not abandonment. One day I will return. Okay. So you guys did have five of pentacles. So you could be wondering if there's someone from your past that maybe was the person you thought you would end up with. If that person might return, if you wanted to, this could be a possible yes. Okay. You, oh, you say I only look at different girls. You like to laugh at me when I look at other girls. I'm a something baby. I'm such a baby. Yeah, the dolphins make me cry. Well, there's nothing I can do. I've been looking for a girl like you. I can't forget you. You're always on my mind. I surrender my love to you. Okay. So I don't know if this is the person that you want or you feel like someone you're you feel like someone is attached to your energy as well, I'm getting. So <clears throat> Okay, let's get some final energy, Sag. You like to laugh at me when I look at other girls. Okay, final energies. 
the emperor this is divine masculine could be dealing with an aries if you're like a feminine watching this could be your counterpart coming here okay that could be happy news for you and i already said the world and here we go guys capricorn energy um you're definitely completing a cycle you've learned the hard lessons your person is coming when you decide to make healthy decisions for you and not have to explain to other people okay all right sag i really hope this reading resonates with you guys please subscribe to my channel if you're new it would mean a lot hit the bell so you get notifications on future readings and i'll see you guys next time bye sag